I'm Shane Gray, driver of the Service Central uh, GXP uh, Pro Stock car. Okay. So what's it like uh, dealing with Jim Yates every single weekend as your crew chief? Good, bad, ugly? Tell no, us the I, truth. No, it's, it's, all, it's real good. It's real good. Jim is a uh, very smart uh, person. He amazes me with his uh, uh, experience and intelligence with a car. Uh, I don't know that there's anybody any better than getting a car from from uh, A to B any better. So it's it's all real good, and we hope that uh, certainly I can hold up my end of the bargain for sure. Well, when we just talked to Jim, he gave you a grade A for for learning to drive, driving smart, doing good on the tree, <laughs> killing the shift points. If you had to give him a grade as a crew chief, what would it be? I'd give Jim between a 95 and a 98. He, uh, the reason that the car is, the reason that I got an A is because Jim has made the car. Jim and Craig Hankinson and John Yates have made the car easy to drive. I mean, this, this deal is not, uh, it doesn't, the easier the car is to drive, the better it makes the driver look. So my car is obviously really easy to drive. So. <laughs> <laughs> Um, tell us what your first reaction was when your father said he was going to go drive a fuel funny car this year instead of sitting next to you with a pro stocker. Well, I guess there was a lot of things up in the air for a while, but my first reaction was I was really, really glad for him because that's that's really what he likes to do. He he likes the pro stock thing because I'm involved in it and you know we have our own engine program and and uh, naturally all this stuff belongs to him but uh, I was real proud to see him get to go and do something that he wanted to go do and uh, I think that he has a talented enough people over there and good enough equipment and I think he's a good enough funny car driver that they're gonna win some races over there so I'm excited for him and after you win a, uh, a Pro Stock Championship, is your next goal going to be getting in a funny car as well? <laughs> well, I don't know. You know, a Pro Stock Championship is a long ways to come. Um, there's a lot of uh, talented, uh, much more experienced drivers out here than myself. So I think maybe a Pro Stock Championship is maybe a... Uh, a a goal that's in in the horizon, but it's it's you know a long ways out there. So first thing we need to do is is try and and win another race and uh, just take it from there. And uh, you know possibly it could happen in a couple of years from now, but we will just go from there. What was the celebration like when you won your first pro stock? race at a national event. I mean, what was that like for, for Shane Gray? Well, it was it was great because I had family in. Uh, we had family in from New Mexico where, we, where we're from. Um, I don't know that it really set in until maybe a couple days afterwards. It was kind of late and we had been working hard all day and uh, everybody's pretty tired after the thing was over, you know, every time we get everything put away and hungry, so we just kind of went out to eat and talked about it a little bit and just counted our blessings and hopefully, you know, we'll be blessed enough to do it again someday. I'm sure you will, there's no <laughs> doubt. Um, tell us, you know, we all know it takes a lot of money to run a pro stocker and we know that, you know, it's always tough, especially in this kind of economy, to get good sponsors. Um, you know, how, how did you guys come to be with NTV and Big O and Merchant and the whole Service Central? <laughs> Well, we uh, those we have a, a contact there. Uh, his name's Lynn Parker, and they they've been watching my dad, you know, throughout the years and, and everything. And it just uh, I don't know, you know. Like I said, I just talked about that deal that we were lucky and blessed. You know, they just decided that when we put both of these pro stock cars out and put an engine shop in, that that they wanted to step forward and help us and. It's man, they're it's they're the best sponsor out here, in, in my opinion, for for what we're doing, for sure. Uh, 
You know, that's that's a really a good question. I I really can't yeah. can't give you an answer on what what they were what they were thinking there, but. Uh, they, they're certainly doing a good job for us, and, and we hope that we're representing them well anyway. If you had to say one thing to all your fans out there, because there's a bunch of them, what would it be for 2011? Follow your dreams and don't give up.